academic excellence on Peralta News. Merritt College is offering a new AA degree in landscape architecture. Landscape architecture um, is considered the fastest growing of all the design professions. I try to structure the classes to mimic what a professional would be doing. And literally when I was teaching and practicing at the same time, I would sometimes work on a project during the day and in the evening go into class and talk about exactly the same things that I had worked on during the day. In my typical design class, my beginning design classes, we focus on uh, drafting and how to draw and articulate your designs graphically because pictures are really the means of communication for a designer. They're very, very important. Uh, students understand that microclimate is really important in their designs. They have to understand the soils, the slope, the shadow patterns, views, um, topography, drainage, all the physical factors that affect a site. They have to have a good understanding of working with budgets and dealing with clients. But we do a variety of projects, mostly on the smaller scale, to get students um, competent to be able to design things for private residences and also to move on and, and work in offices. Every time I mention that I'm in, interested in doing work with plants, everybody has said, you have to go to Merritt College. So um, I finally made it up there, and it's wonderful. We have two programs in our department. One is landscape horticulture, and it encompasses landscape design, construction, uh, parks and maintenance, nursery management, and permaculture. And then we have a sister program, environmental management and technology, which deals with broader issues of environmental protection, green building, urban agroecology. Many of the students in our program now are very interested in edible landscaping and urban farms. And so I thought this would make a good trip here to show uh, show what you can do with a piece of land to grow food. If there's a question you have or a particular thing that interests you about the edible schoolyard or something like that, that'll help me get a sense for what direction to take things. And I always wish that the students could get a degree in landscape architecture and I added planting design, computer assisted landscape design, some graphics classes, really filling out the program to the point where we were um, almost offering as many classes as you'd find in a university bachelor's degree program. And students who complete the degree will fulfill their educational requirement for taking the landscape architecture licensing exam. So this offered my students an opportunity to get licensed that they previously would not have had before no matter how many classes they took.